quick video about backing up the Raspberry Pi. There's obviously a lot of different ways to go about it, but the way I've decided to back up the Pi is to back up the SD card in its entirety and save it as an image file that I'll put onto a, an external USB drive. So to, to do that, we'll open up a web browser and we'll go to the Raspberry Pi site where it discusses backups. So in Google, I'll just type in Raspberry Pi Backup. And this link right here, raspberrypi.org slash Linux slash file system slash backup. That's the link I want to go to. So in this page, it talks about the SD card copier. Now, I don't have a second SD card that I'll be using for a backup. But do note that the device name here for the SD card if we scroll down further into the page, we'll see where it talks about an SD card image. And that the command that's used is sudo dd. Now the input file in this particular command, it's assuming that we're going to be using a second SD card that we want to back up and pull it into an image on the primary SD card. We're going to change this around just a little bit to work in this scenario where, again, I have my SD card running on my Pi and I want to back it up to an external USB drive. So go ahead up and open a terminal. And what we'll do is type in DF. And DF disk free is what the command I think means, but it gives us a list of the drives that we have on, on our Pi. So what I'm looking for is, okay, so here's the device, the M MMC BLK that we saw earlier in the web page. Now there's a, it's appended with a P1, and I think this just means partition one. So we're not going to use this whole name, we're going to use this part of the name for the source. And then the destination, you'll see here is, in my case, listed my external USB drive, and it's mounted as Media Pi Archive. And Archive is the name that I gave my external USB drive. So we'll go and type this command in and we'll make a few changes using the information we see here. So I'll type in sudo space dd space bs equal 4m capital M if equal and that is I believe the input file so we'll say slash dev slash mmc and then I can press tab here and it will autofill with that, um, this device name. So that's my input file. So then we'll do OF output file equal slash media slash pi slash, in this case, sensitive, capital A R C H. You can hit tab to autocomplete. And then I'm going to give it uh, a name raspy backup.img. So I'll go ahead and press enter. So this backup is going to take quite a while to run. But once it completes, on the root of the USB drive, there'll be a raspybackup.img file. Thank you very much for watching. Stay creative.